Well, another year's gone by, and we're joined by Brian Quayle, the president and CEO of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. This event just keeps getting better and better, Brian. Well, Alex, first of all, thank you for being here again this year. We love you guys. And yes, it's bigger and better. And uh, the kids who are all around us, this is what it's all about. And we are so proud that our members today had a chance to do some judging. Well, the uh, gala last night was spectacular. I know you guys have raised a lot of money for this spectacular cause. You told us a little bit about it last year, but quickly summarize what the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County does. Uh, what we do, we serve members in our community, uh, 12,500 members. Our members come from households of uh, annual income, 55% of them, of less than 20,000 annually. 63% of our members live in single parent households and 83% of our kids uh, live in, not live in, but uh, actually benefit from the uh, after school nutrition program. Brian, how gratifying it must be to know what kind of impact that you're having. You're really making a difference in this community. We are, you know, the Charity Navigator, which is a watchdog group on um, the charities in the U.S., about 6,000 charities. We've received their four-star rating four years in a row, and only 7% of the nonprofits that they evaluate get that distinction. We have, with this Concord, this is now our ninth, but the first eight have raised over $7.8 million towards our mission to help our youth in Broward County. It's tremendous. Now tell me more about the impact that the Boca Concours has to help the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Well, one of the things, this is a big part of our budget each and every year. So if you can imagine, uh, you know, this is, we do about 17 events a year. Uh, this is this has got to be the Super Bowl. Then. This is the Super Bowl. This is uh, where you put all the eggs in the basket, it kind of feels like sometimes. But each and every event is unique. And what we've done with the car community here is just awesome. I mean, we have owners that come across all across the country, Canada, to be here. We have judges, same thing. And, you know, when you take the passion of a car owner and the passion of helping kids, this is the result. I mean, and one of the nicest things about this is that we are the only entity, we are the only charity in America that has a Concord versus Concours that are usually run and then they provide support to charities. I mean, this is epic, yeah. epic. And Rick and Rita Case are, were our event founders, Jamie McDonald, our event founding chairman, their energy and Mike Jackson. Mike Jackson, honorary chair this year. Wayne Carini. Wayne Carini, keep it going. Right. This, I'm telling you, this is like, uh, it's like a who's who of like automotive top brass. It's just, it's amazing. I'm like floating on air when I'm here. You know, when you get Auto Nation, Mercedes, JM Family, Ed Morse, uh, Auto Group, uh, Rick and Rita Case, the Case Auto Group. I mean, this is incredible. Impala Asset Management, Fiduciary Trust, excuse me. So when you just get all these great people to support our cause, I mean, sky's the limit. It's a, it's a powerhouse. Uh, was just over uh, saying hi to Clinton Sly. We got Tabitha Hammer here. And look at this, we got the young judges here. Are you guys having a good time today? All right. Now let me ask you guys, what was your favorite car out there? Bentley. What? The Bentley. The Bentley? Yeah, I think I know which one you're talking about. What do you like? Cadillac. Cadillac. Cadillac is the mark of the year this year. What about you? The Bentley. Okay, we got some Bentley lovers here, so we got some British car fans here that's going on. What about you? The 1903 Cadillac. <laughs> Cadillac. All right, I guess that seems to be the way it's going here today. So, Alex, if I can, I just want to thank uh, Haggerty because they have been tremendous partners to us as well. And, you know, what they have done each and every year now to help give the opportunity for our kids to judge cars and to appreciate the car and the car community. So our friends at Haggerty, thank you so much. Uh, we love you guys and look for many, many more years of support and partnership to make this all happen. You know, I think it's very important with all these young kids around here. Uh, you guys love cars, do you? You guys are into cars? Yeah, awesome. You know what, it's our job. I think it's our duty to pass the love of these cars and the hobby on to a new generation and show them the importance of what these cars are. It, no doubt, and uh, that's what today is all about. And again, the folks from Haggerty are helping us to do that, and the owners that come, it's, it's a wonderful thing. It's uh, our pleasure to be here, Brian. Thank you again for everything you've done and rolling out the red carpet for us. Thank you, Alex, uh, we're, we're honored and humbled to have you here again this year with us. Thanks again. Thank you.